What's up, y'all? Today on Garden Talk, I'm going to be talking to my sister-in-law. She has completed the most brave task. You guys, she flew all the way from Chicago in the midst of this corona thing. Look, I can't believe it, but I'm so happy. I want to have this conversation and find out what was it like traveling with that corona thing going on. So, Tiffany, what was it like traveling in the midst of all of this chaos? Well, in Chicago, we've already shut down most of the city. The governor and the mayor have already enacted a stay-at-home curfew. I left about five hours before that got enacted in the city of Chicago. And when I got on the train the morning of the Green Line. I practiced social distancing and made sure that there was only so many people close to me. I got on a separate train car than everybody else. That was fine. When I transferred from the Green Line to the Blue Line, there was no one who got on the train at all the entire time from Parking Lake to O'Hare. So there was really no risk of exposure there, even though I made sure to sanitize the space anyway. But once I got here, it was perfectly fine. There still aren't a lot of people out. I don't feel like there's any risk of exposure for me. There wasn't even anyone on the plane who coughed or sneezed that I was aware of. So at this point, I just think it's been not as much of a scare as the media has made it out to be. How much did you spend on this flight? When I looked for the ticket, it started at about $60, but because I chose to do it from a Saturday to a Monday, I got the ticket down to $96 on American Airlines. Wow. And was this, is this round trip? This is round trip. Whoa. And most of the time, any ticket from Chicago to Memphis airports um, are never less than like $200. Cool. Would you say that this trip was worth it? I would definitely say that it's worth it because the ticket was inexpensive. I got to come down here a quick trip for the weekend to come visit family members that I haven't seen in a really long time. And considering what occurred last year in my life, I had some surgeries and it really made me value my family. And just knowing that I don't get to see this family enough, I'm very glad and I feel like it was definitely worth it to come down here. Cool, cool. There you have it. My sister-in-law says she's having a good time and she is glad she made that trip. She has no fear. And that's what we need in these trying times. Thank you guys so much for watching Garden Talk and I'll see y'all on the next one.